how you going? Uh, you'd think I'd be used to this by now with Citroen Province and all, but uh, no, nah, still super weird talking to a camera. Uh, I just wanted to give you guys a bit of an update because there's a couple of things happening with the channel this year that I thought warrant its own video. Um, plus, this is kind of nice. It might be weird, but it's kind of nice. It's actually kind of a special day for me today. Today marks three years since I uploaded my very first video to YouTube. And some of you guys probably still remember it. It was a trailer for my City Skyline series Springwood, and it honestly kickstarted a pretty unexpected chapter in my life. It took me months to get my CD ready for the trailer, and I ended up re-recording half the footage when I decided a month later that Springwood would be set in the 80s. It's pretty outdated these days, but I'm still proud that it's my first uploaded video. Uh, I do have some more updates about Springwood later in this video, but spoiler alert, it's, it's bad news. So probably the biggest change and most exciting change for 2020 is that I'm going to be going part-time, uh, one day a week on my channel. Uh, that is, I've dropped one day of work from my regular 9 to 5 job to instead of be doing YouTube my now second job, which is really exciting. And look, I know that one day a week doesn't sound very exciting, but uh, to me it really is. One day a week means that I've got one day to then dedicate to my channel. It's one day uninterrupted, one day where I can go, this is my job, this is what I'm doing and I'm going to do it. Um, whereas usually the channel takes sort of a bit of a second for my other job, of course. It's something I do when I get home from work, it's something I could do on the weekends, it's, I squeeze it into every little opportunity that I get throughout the day, throughout the week, and that's fine because I love doing it, but one day a week where I'm officially working on the channel, that's craziness. When I first uploaded that video to YouTube three years ago, my goal was not to go part-time as a YouTuber or even to call myself as a YouTuber, I just wanted people to see what I was creating and wanted to sort of branch out and get a bit of feedback and see what happened. This channel has opened up so much for me, it's just crazy. And now the fact that I am able to do this part time, it blows my mind. And I honestly owe you guys so much for that. I really, really appreciate anyone who's ever watched, liked, shared, commented on any of my videos, to all my patrons who support me as well. It's just ridiculous, and I just wanted to say a massive thank you to you guys. Probably should have saved this to the very end, but then you might not watch the very end. I want you to hear this. Thank you guys so much for all your support. It really means a lot. So, what does one day a week mean for the channel? Prior to this, I was only really able to do one to two videos a week. Mostly only one video. Uh, I'm currently on holidays at the moment, so I'm able to produce a fair bit more. But when I go back to work, I'm hoping that one day a week, I'll be able to do two to three videos each week with potentially a live stream. So you're looking at potentially three videos. I think it'd probably be about three videos a week. Um, that's maybe two videos, one live stream, or three videos. We'll see how we go. It means more content. So this is probably a good segue into the next announcement, and you guys probably already know this, but uh, I've updated my PC, which means that I am now able to live stream. Yes, because I have always had massive dramas of live streaming. First it was my internet, and then I fixed that, and then it was my computer, and then I fixed my internet, and then I fixed my computer, and here we are. We are now able to live stream, and it's glorious. So I'm hoping to be able to live stream maybe like once a week, once a fortnight. I love live streaming and uh, I just want to do it all the time. So that's something to look forward to in 2020. And I uh, have always got my components and stuff inside my computer listed in the description in every single video. Don't bother asking me any questions about it. I don't know anything about it. It just works. That's all I want to know. And then last announcement is about Springwood. You guys remember how I said Springwood would never die? Well, Springwood is dead. I'm so sorry. I don't want to announce that it's dead because I love Springwood as well. Look, the story with Springwood, and if you don't know Springwood, Springwood was my very first series. It's kickstarted everything, and I was adamant that I would never stop this series. I just keep on going, keep on building. And last year, I released an episode, or a couple of episodes, and it was like, the first couple of episodes for forever and I said we're gonna keep doing this we're gonna keep on going uh, unfortunately I can't get the save game to open anymore uh, I tried about August last year and I had full intention to just whip out a whole bunch of new episodes I could not get that save game to open I tried again towards the end of 2019 but uh, it just was not happening so I just figured 
let's just say it's finished. I really hate to say that because I do love Springwood so much, but uh, I also kind of just want to move on, you know, it's... I would have continued it if I could have got the same save game open, but now that I can't, it's kind of just like, you know what, let's just move on. I've got some new ideas for some series, I've, got, I've always got ideas for series I want to do in City Skylines, but I've got some new ideas that I really want to explore, and I kind of just want to push for that, rather than trying to open something that I started three years ago. So I'm really sorry for those people who've been holding out. Uh, you're holding out because I, you know, made you believe that it was going to happen. I thought it was going to happen. I don't think it's going to happen. Before I go, I want to give a special shout out to a couple of people who have really supported the channel over the last couple of years. Burn Mark, Bob Ducati, Brandon Ash, Holly Sovdi, Leisure, Alec Williams, Clayton Hawk, Stephen Hayner, Aiden Mann, John Van Gert, Theory Barag, Winding Willow, Sibo, and Christopher C. Penny. Those people who have been supporting me on Patreon for over a year now, and there's a lot of other people over there as well. If you are someone who has liked, shared, commented, uh, watched one of my videos, thank you so much for all your support. Um, every single one of you guys has been part of the reason why I'm able to do this part-time, reason why I have been able to travel overseas to do what I do. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Uh, that is it. Thank you guys for watching. By the way, it's I know the lighting has changed. It's not because this has taken me six hours to record. I The camera died and then I ordered pizza and now it's dark. So that's why. Anyway, thank you guys so much. I'll see you in later videos. Bye.